so basically i just wanted to create an use case uh, which looks something like this so basically create a google drive folders and create trello cards from a new row inside google sheet so basically whenever a new row is triggered is added to the bottom of a spreadsheet i'm going to create a new empty folder on google drive and also add a new card to the specific board and the list on trello so let's see this how we can actually do it all inside using connect set so first you have to log in to connect it so once you log in you will click on apps page so once you are in apps page make sure you authorize this accounts so that is basically in this use case it is google drive trello and also google sheet so make sure you authorize these accounts and then you create a workflow so first i will going to show you how to authorize google drive so similarly you have to follow the same thing for google sheets and also trello so just search for your app click on the app and click on add account so once you do that so it will give ask you for permission to give access for connect so just click on your account so once you click on your account so it will going to ask you for the services which connect will be having access for you have to click on continue so this will going to authorize google drive inside connect so similarly you have to follow the same step for google sheet and also for trello so now let's go ahead and build our workflow so i'll just start by creating connects so now i will be taking google sheet as my trigger so whenever there is a new row created on google sheet i will be taking that as my trigger just drag and drop google sheet as our trigger select your account so in sheet and select the spreadsheet and select the sheet where you want to you know get the trigger for new row and you have to it on test and review so once you it on test and review a new pop-up window will be opening so where you have to add the trigger uh, manually so basically you have to do some setup so i'll be showing how to do that so first click on your account so make sure you enable app script so add shown uh, if you can watch google sheet window so uh, trigger so video you will be get to know how to do that so just click on add new trigger so we will be need to trigger so whenever there is a on change and we have to get notified Im immediately just click on save so this will going to add an app script called connect new row into google sheet so don't worry about the warning even if you are getting so because you are adding app script on to your page itself and then click on allow so this will going to add a new trigger inside connect sheet so inside your google sheet which does look like this so now let us go back to connect sheet so we will get a first row fetch from our google sheet so my google sheet look like this so the first row will be get fetched to connect it automatically so now we got a trigger from google sheet so now we will be creating a new folder inside our drive just search for google drive app and drag and drop google drive and connect it actually support all these actions so basically you can create a folder inside google drive or even you can create a files copy the file rename your file or move file from one folder to another folder or one place to another folder and upload your file as well so now in this use case so i'm just creating a folder so whenever there is a new row created on my google sheet so i will just select create folder option so if you have any parent folder so you can just select that or you can always leave empty so I, I do have a parent folder just i will select that folder and it asks me for a name 
so now let me go ahead and give the name folder name directly from the folder name column of google sheet so and it on test and review so this will going to automatically create a new folder inside my google drive so this is my google drive look like you can see that a new folder is been created inside my google drive so now let's go back to connect it and create a card inside trello so just search for trello app and drag and drop the app select your account and select the action as create card so basically we are creating a new card on our new row entry inside google sheet i will select card and we have to select which board the card belongs to so i'll be selecting the board name and also the list so i'll just select as to do so now i we need to create a name and also the description i'm going to add the name as same as folder name or else maybe i will go ahead and use the speaker name here as a name of the card and then add the webinar details as the description of my card so now i am going to it on test and review so this will going to automatically create a card by name my name the our speaker name and also with the description connects it onboarding webinar so let's go to my trello account so you can see that my with my name at card is created with the description of connects it onboarding webinar so this is how we can create a card inside trello so whenever there is a new row inside google sheet so let me name my connects as google sheet to google drive so let me go ahead and publish my connect so now any row created on my google sheet automatically create a card inside my trello board and also it will going to create a new folder on google drive so now let's go ahead and create a new row inside google sheet so let me going to name this as connects it to and then as l demo and then author as rocky so let me go ahead and name one more folder for verification purpose as connects it three and then name it as demo and then name the speaker as john so now let's go ahead and search for two options that means we have to create get folder created according to our connects so basically inside our google sheet so a new folder should be created by name that is connects it two and connects it three so now let's go ahead and google sheet you can see that google drive automatically a new empty folder will be created by name connects it two and also connects it three so basically those are empty so now let's go to trello and search for options so you can see that a new card has been added inside trello with the name rocky and also john with the description as l demo and inside john it will be demo so this is how you can actually create a card inside trello and create a folder on google drive so basically whenever there is a new row on your google sheet so let me know guys if you have any doubts on this particular integration do drop in the comment section below thanks for watching this video have a great day